We caught some choppy surf near the home of the San Francisco Giants today. Three large barges were even sent crashing into the historic Third Street Bridge next to the ballpark. Thankfully, no one was hurt. ABC 7 News reporter J.R. Stone continues our team coverage. These three barges did do damage to the Third Street Bridge, but they also did damage in this area here near the walkway at Oracle Park. This light is now tilted and sections of concrete fell off the side here. Some of that concrete is still loose right now. This is what the calm after the storm looked like in McCovey Cove near Oracle Park. Even after the most intense moments, three loose barges could be seen grinding against the city's historic Third Street Bridge. It looked like there were construction barges that uh, were uh, being used uh, going back and forth to ferry equipment. Uh, how they ended up uh, in the channel, uh, I'm not quite sure. It's unclear how close the barges were to the bridge before the incredible waves and winds pushed them there. It appeared that three barges uh, were banging up against the side of the bridge and the way the winds were kicking up the tide, the waves, uh, it was just banging back and forth. Tuesday night, San Francisco Public Works showed us where the damage was to the bridge's wood walkway. Then the damage to these metal plates. One of those plates fell in the water and now there is a hole, a reason why the pedestrian walkway is closed. Sides of the operator house were damaged by the barges too, along with fender piles in the water, but San Francisco city engineer Albert Coe says the bridge is safe. After a careful assessment, it looks like the main structural members are intact, so we're pretty good to go. Uh, it's going to stay up. Uh, most of the damage was secondary. Car lanes are back open on the bridge, while pedestrian lanes remain closed. Crews say when the weather clears, they will do a full assessment and use boats to go under the bridge. In San Francisco, J.R. Stone, ABC 7 News.